I'm going to guide us through a quick tapping sequence that you can use if you've been experiencing what I like to refer to as, I just want to be mean to this person. <laughs> so what I'd like you to do first is just think of this person that you just want to be mean to. <laughs> and you know, maybe there's some kind of aggravating or triggering situation that's got you really feeling that way. So you can think about that as well if it's relevant. And notice what you feel in your body as you do think of it. So you might feel some, some pressure in your chest or head maybe, or some tension in your shoulders. Uh, just notice what's there for you, and then we'll start tapping on the side of the hand. Even though I just want to be mean to this person, <laughs> I'm open to loving and accepting myself. Even though some part of me just wants to be really mean to this person, I'm open to loving and accepting myself. Even though there's some part of me, at least, that wants to be really mean to this person, I'm open to loving and accepting all parts of me anyways. Alright, and go ahead and tap on the top of the head. I just want to be mean to this person. <laughs> tap on the eyebrow. <sighs> I just want to be mean to this person. Tap on the side of the eye. Yeah, my inner mean girl or mean guy or whatever you relate to <laughs> is really, really activated. <laughs> Tap under the eye. I just really want to be mean to this person. Tap under the nose. I just really want to be mean to this person. And I kind of know exactly what I want to do to them. <laughs> Tap under the lips and just check in if that feels true for you. And also if it does, what exactly you might be wanting to do to them. Tap on the collarbone. You might be wanting to hurl insults at them. <laughs> Call them names tap under the arm. You might want to exclude them from different events that are happening with some group that you're both part of, perhaps. Tap on the top of the head. Or maybe you want to say bad things about them behind their back to people that know them. <laughs> tap on the eyebrow. Yeah, I just want to be really mean to this person. Tap on the side of the eye. I want to be really mean to this person. Tap under the eye. I want to be really mean to this person. Tap under the nose. I want to be so mean to this person. Tap under the lips. I want to be really mean to them because they make me really mad. Tap on the collarbone and just check in if that's true for you at all. Tap under the arm. Yeah, I kind of want to be mean to them because they make me really mad and maybe I even kind of hate them. Tap on the top of the head and you can check in if that's relevant for you in any way. I'm not going to fully go into processing hate in this video, but I do have another one on the topic, so if that's relevant to you and resonates for you, you can go ahead and tap along with that one as well. You might find that helpful. Tap on the eyebrow. Yeah, I really want to be so mean to this person. They're just making me so mad. Tap on the side of the eye. I just want to be so mean to this person, and I think I kind of want to get a reaction of some sort out of them with it tap under the eye and just check in if that's true and if it is you can notice what kind of reactions you might be hoping for tap under the nose yeah you know I kind of want to just get a reaction out of them of some sort tap under the lips and just notice again what's there for you so you might be wanting to make them cry or hurt their feelings in some way tap on the collarbone or, you know, you might be wanting to make them not hang around with whatever group that you're part of together <laughs> that you don't want them in. <laughs> Tap under the arm. Yeah, I kind of want to get some kind of reaction from them. Tap on the top of the head. Maybe you even just want them to have some understanding of how much they hurt other people with their actions. Tap on the eyebrow. I want to get some kind of reaction out of them on the side of the eye. I really want to be mean to them and I really want to get some kind of reaction out of them. Tap under the eye. And I think there's a part of me that's kind of excited to be mean to them. Tap under the nose and just check in if that's relevant or present for you. Tap under the lips. Yeah, I'm kind of excited to be mean to them, actually. Tap on the collarbone. I have thought of all these great insults and it would be a shame to waste them. Tap under the arm. <laughs> I thought of all these ways to hurt them and be mean to them, and like I really just want to do it. <laughs> Tap on the top of the head. I'm kind of excited to be mean to them. It seems like it'll be fun. <laughs> Tap on the eyebrow. 
I kind of feel like it's going to be fun to be mean to them, actually. <laughs> Tap on the side of the eye, and I'm really excited about that. Tap under the eye. <sighs> yeah, I kind of just want to be mean to them. <laughs> Tap under the nose, and I'm really excited about it and think it'll be kind of fun <laughs> in some way. <laughs> Tap under the lips. It'd be such a shame to waste all my great insults. <laughs> have on the collarbone. I kind of wonder why I want to be so mean to them. Tap under the arm. And just check in if you've got any curiosity about that. Tap on the top of the head. <sighs> yeah, I sort of wonder exactly why I want to be so mean to them. Tap on the eyebrow. I mean, and maybe there's no reason. <laughs> maybe I just want to be mean to them. Tap on the side of the eye. That's cool too. <laughs> Tap under the eye. But maybe there's some reason why I want to be mean to them. Tap under the nose. And I'm kind of curious about that. Tap under the lips and just check in if anything comes up for you. Any particular reasons why you feel like you want to be mean to them. Tap on the collarbone. Could be that you're jealous of them. <sighs> Tap under the arm. Or maybe you're kind of like frenemies where they're part of some group of friends but you don't actually like them at all. Or want to hang out with them. Tap on the top of the head. Or maybe they kind of constantly overstep boundaries or something like that that causes you to have some aggravation with them. Tap on the eyebrow. Or maybe it's more about them and how they probably are expecting people to treat them than about you. Tap on the side of the eye. I'm kind of curious as to just why I want to be so mean to them. Tap under the eye. And you know, maybe there's not even really any reason. <laughs> Tap under the nose but I kind of still want to be mean to them. <laughs> Tap under the lips. I'm kind of finding that I still want to be mean to them. Tap on the collarbone. And maybe a, a part of me at least would like to be open to some other possibilities. Tap under the arm. <sighs> that don't involve me being mean to them. Tap on the top of the head. Even though maybe part of me doesn't want to be open to those possibilities and just wants to be mean to them and thinks that it won't be fun if I can't. <laughs> Tap on the eyebrow. Maybe there's, you know, some other possibilities. Tap on the side of the eye. I like to kind of try to be open to them. At least part of me does. <laughs> Tap under the eye. Even if part of me is like, I don't want any other possibilities. I just want to be mean to this person and have fun about it. <laughs> Tap under the nose. But you know, maybe there are some other possibilities. Tap under the lips. Like maybe I could kind of speak up about any boundaries that I need. Tap on the collarbone and stand up for myself. Tap under the arm and not have to feel obligated to be around them if I don't really want to. Tap on the top of the head. And maybe I could even find some kind of fun creative outlet for whatever's I'm experiencing, tap on the eyebrow, maybe I could do insult comedy or performance pieces or creative writing <laughs> or cartoons, tap on the side of the eye. <sighs> so you know, maybe I can still have fun and speak my mind, tap under the eye and you know, not have to actually try to be mean to this person <laughs> and hurt them, tap under the nose. Maybe there's some other options. Tap under the lips. And maybe there's even other options that I haven't even thought of that are even better than all of this. Tap on the collarbone. And you know, even though part of me might think, I don't know if I can be open to these options, maybe a part of me would like to be open to them. Tap under the arm. And whether I can be open to any other possibilities or not, either way I like to be okay and just accept myself as I am. All right, so let's just check in again. So take a nice deep breath. And go ahead and think back to this person that you feel like you really want to be mean to. <laughs> and if there is a situation that's, you know, your aggravating or triggering situation, you can go ahead and think of that too. Just tune into your body as you do think of it and notice what's there for you now. So you might be feeling quite a bit lighter about the whole thing and like maybe you don't even want to be mean to them anymore. You might have also thought of, you know, some 
kind of ways that you want to enforce some boundaries and stand up for yourself or others in some way. Um, or you might have thought of some other possible forms of action you could take. Uh, it's also possible that maybe you had some memories coming up of some past situations where you felt a similar way and so if that happened sometimes it can be really useful to work on those with the tell the story technique and kind of clear away any hurt feelings from the past as well and in my opinion as we're kind of op opening up to you know other possibilities and ways to act then we can choose the one that's truly in line with what we need to do uh, and and communicate you know with a little bit more love and sensitivity um, and sometimes that can be more productive than just kind of like hurling insults at people even though sometimes people might kind of seem like they deserve it <laughs> there there are different choices and so we can we can actually choose to act different ways in different scenarios uh, the more we reflect on it <laughs>